Hey guys, and welcome back for another video. So this one's going to be kind of a short one. I'm just going to address this very quickly and let it go because I don't like back and forth arguments. And I understand that a lot of times, no matter what you say, people are going to come to their own conclusions anyway. But I'd be a fool not to address a video or something that mentioned visions of freaking Asia. Okay, I'm going to always say something, baby. But anyway, so let's go ahead and watch a snippet from a video from a young lady named Lashid for you. So many people, they claim to be so sick of black women, yet they follow the channels with black women in it. And they seek any and every bit of news and information on black women, especially if it's negative news and info. Now, I recall this one right here. You see, I recall her co-signing white racists who were calling Rashida Strobas all kind of apes and monkeys and racist-ish like years ago. And that's back when you could post the N-word and all of that and get away with it. Now. Oh, she's talking about the Rashida video on Kendrick Lamar that was done over seven years ago. Okay, we'll let you continue though. I might be wrong, but all I have to do is check my archives on that. But yeah, I recall this one right here. I recall her being one of those biracials who had me kind of in shock because I'm just thinking, no, nah, this can't be, these can't be biracials co-signing this ish. Yeah, but now look, it looked like she's using black women to establish her channel trying to be like another Jessica X. I mean, there are a couple of these suspected Karen's daughters up in here who are luring black male viewers to, to join them and, and pay them to disrespect their own women, black women. <sighs> All right. So number one, clearly you've got me mistaken with someone else because honey, I've not even been on YouTube for years. I've literally been on YouTube for just about two years. Let's go ahead and prove that by going to the about section of my channel. Now with that being said, let's go ahead and look at some of the content that I have displayed on my channel. Hmm, this is interesting. So if my channel was completely about bashing black women, wouldn't all of my videos be on black women? Because it seems like there's a lot of white faces in there. I'm, I'm confused. Like, why would there be white people on my channel if I was only talking and bashing black women? Hmm. Well, apparently, you're not watching the channel. You're looking and making assumptions, which is a very bad thing to do because it makes you look like an asshole. <laughs> you know what they say, right? When you assume, you make not only an ass out of me, but also yourself. And that's exactly what you've done here, Lashid, for you. You're completely wrong. Number one, I've never co-signed anyone saying anything about Rashida. I literally have a video on Rashida and that's simply because she made a video about me because I made a comment in her comment section and she has every right to. If I come to your channel and I come for you, you have every right to come for me. So I came for her technically back. And so that's squash, that's all over. I got nothing against the lady. In fact, I probably got more respect for her than I do you, <laughs> just saying, but anyway, you guys, obviously, I am talking about feminism on my channel. I am uh, deeply into like the manosphere and why men are completely pretty much diverting and, and, and going their own way. That's what MGTOW stands for. It's because men are tired of women and how we have taken like our society and just made it so effed up. Like the single mom thing is trash. And I've learned that for myself. And I've literally displayed my own life on this channel as well. So you can go back in my history and watch and see how I've changed and overcame a lot of stuff in my own life. And that's why, because I've changed and overcame, I feel the need to talk about it and maybe help others or address issues that are on my mind. That's what YouTube is about. It's about speaking our minds and I have every right to do so. Just because you're offended by the truth doesn't mean anything. I'm not on here making fun of people because they're black. I'm on here making fun of people because of the way they act. You know, and it's definitely not just black women. Now, granted, a lot of my videos are dealing with black folks. Well, guess what? I'm a biracial person who's been forced to grow up in a predominantly black community. So therefore, most of the issues that I'm going to come across or most of the issues that directly affect me or concern me are going to be within the black community because that's the community that I've grown up in. And so if that's hard for you to understand, then I don't know what else to say about it. I can't make you walk a day in my shoes to understand. You can't. So you would have to just take my word for it. And if you're not, and you're going to prejudge and make assumptions, that's on you. But you guys, 
I don't hate anybody because of the color of their skin. That's some bull crap. And as a biracial person, to come off racist, it's almost nearly impossible. Like, my genealogy is too <laughs> screwed up and too mixed up to even be racist against anybody. Like, I'm literally black and white. My name is Asia. I look like I could be Arabian or some shit, or even, even Hispanic in a way. So it's like, how could I be racist against it's anything? I'm racially ambiguous as freak. Like, look at this hair. Is this black people hair? Is this white people hair? What kind of hair is this? What kind of nose is this? What kind of lips are these? Like, who even knows? <laughs> you know? So I'm just a human freaking being, a female who comes online and talks about issues that either, again, directly affect me or just interest me. That's what my channel's about. What interests me? And not all of them are negative. I wish you would take the time to watch and figure it out. You might actually like it. Well, anyway, guys, that's it. I hope you have a great day. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.